Hi, I'm Tara from Smart Deploy. On this edition of Smart Tech Tips, we are gonna make an answer file with a custom machine name. Let's dive in. Okay, so do you love the automation, but you have some machines that you need to create a custom name for? I do. I, I love being very specific. So I'm gonna show you how to do that. I'm gonna to go to my answer file and I'm gonna right click and I'm gonna say edit. Then I'm gonna click on the advanced tab. I'm gonna to go to the general tab and I'm gonna put a check mark in the attended, okay? Then I'm gonna hit okay. Once I hit okay, it's gonna add a skip this page in the lower left-hand corner. This is gonna allow me to skip any, any screen, any part of this that I wanna have be automated. So I'm gonna make sure I skip every page until I get to the one with the naming convention on it. I'm gonna make sure and leave that one unchecked. Then I'm gonna to go to the very top and I'm gonna add the name, the custom name to the very top of the field, right? Cause I don't wanna waste any time. Then I'm gonna finish it out, making sure I'm skipping this page. So this one's gonna be mostly attended except for the custom name. Cause remember I wanna add that name. I'm gonna next my way to victory. I'm gonna hit save and then save that answer file. And that's gonna allow me to add the custom name for any machine I want. So ideally you're gonna have multiple answer files. One where it allows me a custom name for like bare metal machines and then one where it's just fully automated. This gives you options. So give this a try. Let me know what you think in the comments. I'd love to hear. I'm Tara, thanks for watching.